Hello everybody, welcome to Couple Gaming. So today I'm gonna show you how to play GTA 5 on custom roleplay servers or pretty much custom servers. So this is the option for uh, if people got the game from Epic Games. So as you can see here, Grand Theft Auto 5. All right. So first thing you'll have to go on this particular website, 5m.net. I'll have this linked in the description as well. You just need to download the client. After you download the client, it's gonna install and it's gonna ask you to find GTA 5 XE. So generally, if you have Epic Games, you should be able to find it pretty easy. So right here, it's Epic Games. Right here, GTA 5 XE. Make sure you select this when uh, prompted for the Fiverr itself. So this will work without a problem. Some servers will need you to actually have Steam open for it to work. So make sure if the if it gives you any errors or anything like that, make sure you just open Steam first. So you do not have to have Epic Games open after you install 5M. You just need to re register right here. Don't uh, don't go with the settings. Don't do anything from the settings. Leave them as that is. You click play. You have right now a million servers right here. If you want to add something to your favorite, you can literally click the little star right here or click on it and they will tell you what kind of server this is. If you click it right here, it will tell you what kind of resource they use, how many players and so on. Generally, I like to I like a specific server, so I'm going to show you right now that this actually works. Transport icon right here, you click on it and then you click connect. For the first time, it's going to load the resources and it's going to take a little bit of time. Depending on the server, uh, they're going to ask you to downgrade or upgrade the version of Fiverr, 5M right here. Uh, generally, it, it kind of does it automatically. You just need to press OK. <clears throat> uh, best option when playing on a server, let it load for a little bit. The first time you enter, exit, enter back again, play for 20 minutes, exit, and then enter again. So it can load all the system. If the server is not acting properly and you cannot actually manage to load it properly and so on, the best advice will be getting away from that server is not very well optimized. Uh, there are some specific servers, for example, some popular ones that they have their own launcher. With those specific servers, do not download the special launch launcher because that will not actually work it will only work on servers that have this particularly 5M right here that you can actually play on. So if you go to a specific website and they tell you to download their launcher, don't do it because it's not going to work. If you, gave, if you have any type of errors and that particular server do not start, make sure you open Steam in the background. And right now I'm going to quickly show you that it actually works so you'll know exactly what you can expect from it. If you have any type of question or problems, feel free to leave them in the comments and don't forget to like and probably subscribe. That would be a great option. So right now we're loading in. The first time is going to take a little bit of time. Make sure you do the settings if you want the graphics up and so on before you actually go into this particularly 5M. So you're not going to open it through GTA normally or GTA online or anything like that. Those characters do not transfer to the servers. Your money do not transfer to the servers. So do not ask questions about that. Make sure you don't actually try to cheat in this because you will get banned and I don't think you'll appreciate that because they're banning from IP so you cannot uh, remove that. As you can see I loaded in, everything works, I have some special things right here. Well, that's about it. Thank you very much for watching and make sure you like and subscribe. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.